I'm Ty Quinones right now on your 13 Action News update. A man is dead and a woman is in custody after a deadly wrong way crash on the airport connector. With well, that wreck closing the northbound lanes for several hours this morning, NHP says a 20 year old Sierra Bra has now been charged with driving under the influence. But well, the man police say she killed has been identified as 45 year old Christopher Garcia. Brar was taken to the hospital with minor injuries. Las Vegas police have released some new video in an officer involved shooting. It happened on Wednesday. Officers say that a man kidnapped his mother, then took her to her bank on Spring Mountain and Rainbow and then shot her. Well, bank surveillance shows the suspect William Jackson while walking his mother to a teller to withdraw some $2,000. He then starts firing shots and she tries to run away. Well, she, shot, she was shot some three times and is expected to be okay. Well, Jackson right now is facing multiple charges. And NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell spent the morning with local business leaders on the Strip. Preview Las Vegas was hosted at the win by the Las Vegas Chamber of Commerce. Leaders talked about how sports will and already is revolutionizing our valley. Goodell also hinted at the possibility of Las Vegas hosting a Super Bowl and a Pro Bowl. Danny. A pretty great Friday night forecast ahead of us. Temperatures are going to dip into the upper 40s by about 8 p.m. So if you do have any of those dinner plans, grab the jackets. But partly cloudy skies, dry conditions, and light wind. For your Saturday, we'll see partly to mostly cloudy skies. With highs in the upper 50s, we do bounce back up to the 60s starting Sunday through the start of next week. Danny, thank you. That was your 13 Action News update. Remember, you can always get the latest news at KTNV.com. Thank you for making 13 Action News part of your day.